of our Minecraft Feed the Beast Let's Play series. So, been working on this reed farm here. You know, I've <laughs> been gone a little bit, you know, trying to do stuff on my own time. <laughs> Didn't have uh, much time to play any Minecraft at all, unfortunately. It's been kind of a, kind of one of those weeks. But, as I said, we are setting up the reed farm here. Pretty simple, just have a large area here. I have the center open because I'm planning on just having a reed harvester right up the center. And as you can see, we got a really good layout here. We can fit about as much as possible into this area. And if I want to set it up, I can actually just bring up a couple blocks and set up another layer. It depends on where I put that reed harvester. Another thing that I've just been doing, uh, want to get a nice little nether hub type place you know set up and you know just listen to music being quiet and whatnot and sit, just clearing out a nice large area doing it all manual instead of with you know uh, instead of using like a filler or something to clear this out I've just been going through a bunch of sapphire picks and clearing out a bunch of area and really that's just cause uh, in a way, I, with all this <laughs> machines and everything, I miss the vanilla play style and just going and messing with things and clearing out a huge area by hand is nice and relaxing. It's really what I like most about the game. It's really what I've been drawn to the, since the beginning and it's nice to just go back to doing that every once in a while. It makes me feel a lot better and <laughs> enjoy the game a lot more and as you can tell with the fact that I've been having a little bit of trouble in the last bit of the time finding time to actually play I really need to you know just get a little bit more into how, what I enjoy playing about the game and I'm sure the more I do that the more you'll enjoy watching but today like I said, we're getting that, and all I'm going to do is, this is started up, and, oh, there we go, another one grown. Ah, hi, skeleton. Oh, that's it. You're fine up here until you didn't start hitting me. I don't know how, peop how these guys keep getting in here. I thought I closed this off well enough, but guess not. <sighs> yeah, but what we're gonna do is we're gonna get the actual reed harvester machine set up. So I wonder, I think that area is where all these bats are spawning. They're all over the place. I have to keep killing them. For the reed harvester, we need a few things. We've got the logger and sugarcane glass. Sugarcane and glass we can take care of quite easily, but the logger, what we need to do is we need diamantine electron tubes and a sturdy casing. Sturdy casing is also fairly easy. We've got our carpenter set up over here, which is good for making the sturdy casing. We just need to empty it out. I have the, what is it, the pipette, I think it's called. Somewhere around here. Where, oh, there you go. Okay, let's take this. And we pull all the seed oil out. Okay, and so I know there's seed oil in here. Then what we do is... Okay, and we pump water into here. And we'll erase this. So, copper should be what I'm looking at to make those sturdy casings. I think I just do that. 
Or do wait, this isn't a carpenter one, is it? Is it just a crafting? Oh, that makes it so much easier. <laughs> I don't even need the copper, do I? I just I need uh brass. Brass that's what it is. Bronze. Brass bronze, whatever. Get that there. And three of you. And should make some brassing bronzing it. Okay, and let's go over to one of our tables over here. Set this up. Sturdy casing. Oh, you know what? We have. We need to make this, don't we? And that. The carpenter we is what we'll use for the basic circuit board, is what it is. I hope the ingredients are in here, because I don't quite remember them. Circuit board. Okay. doesn't have the ingredients for that. One second. Okay, so we need redstone. Where is it? Oh, there it is. One, two, three. One, two, three. And ten. Ten. Sweet, we've got an extra one. That's nice. Throw that in here. Throw these in here. And circuit board. Should have enough energy to build that, right? Oh, no, I need to turn this on for a second. And build up some energy while that's finishing that up. Go take a rest, make sure it's daytime. Whew. All right. Now, the thermionic fabricator is what we need to get for that other part. We'll get it while this is built, making. Okay, that's the seed oil pipette. Now, uh, thermionic fabricator. Therm. Yeah, okay, there we go. Let's see, you need another sturdy casing. Oh, crap. And glass chest gold. The gold, easy. Sturdy casing, not so much. Ten oh, wait, I can use this, can I? Uh, one, two, three. I'm gonna need another one, isn't it? Let's go there. Oh, give me that. Uh, 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 one, two, three, four. Drop that all back in here. And we'll have another sturdy casing up and going. Mm, mm, mm. And we need gold, chest, and that. I have a chest in one of these. There we go. Chest. Okay, we get that in the center, chest on the bottom. These three here, and then that means four pieces of gold, right? One, two, three, four. And this should be it. Ba 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 ba. <laughs> I must click the other one. <laughs> uh huh. Here. And come on, run. Okay, there, and gold transport pipe. Let's grab one of these. Here. No, there. Okay. And that should power our thermionic fabricator. We've got our circuit board. And we need glass for this, don't we? Let's see. Glass. Should be plenty. Glass. Okay, well, what do we need? We need one, two, three, four. Uh, if I remember correctly, we need four diamonds and two redstone. So put the redstone here and here. Three, four, and I think we need another diamond there too. Should heat up. Oh, one second. Let's take you and shut you off. That way you stop sucking all the MJs. Yeah, this thing takes so much power to run. Thank you. I've been making a bit of smooth stone as well while I've been going along. That way we have a bit more to do things like flatten out this area. As you can see, <laughs> I actually went around and I 
Got all the floors smooth. Oh, there you are. Die. And so yeah, now that's nice and smooth on all these areas. I've been running that up and down the walls to fill that up. It doesn't work so well, but yeah, well, you know. Just not as good at programming as I thought. <laughs> or at least not those. I need to spend a little bit more time with it, I think. Okay, we don't need any more circuit boards. Hey. Hey. Are you going to warm this up? Oh, come on. That's what it needs, isn't it? Get the glass in there. Gotta warm it up. It's not like there's too much stuff using up power here. Oh, this is still sucking up power. <laughs> it's off, but it just needs to run until that's done. Hmm. You know, I really do need to finish building four more of my magmatic engines. Get that nice array ready for whenever we need the power. Okay, and okay, that's nice and full. Right, so sweet that's all we needed I guess I remembered it properly so we'll go back over here throw this in place and and we need a logger is that correct yes logger it's a basic circuit board the four glass and three of these diamantine tubes why does it make four if you only need three world may never know. <laughs> oh, sweet. You got enough reeds. Two, three, four, five, six. And we can start setting up a couple of these as well. Let's take this one over. Go over here and one, two, three, four. Uh, did I get this wrong? There it is, sugarcane harvester, nice. We're gonna throw this in here. Uh, one, two, three. It's six high, so if I go one, two, three, four. No, that's, that's one too high. Okay, so same level here, and then six up is what I believe. Mm, we need some more conductive piping been blowing it all up so let's just build some more really quick one two and there wrong way all right and there thank you thank you oh where are you where are you not there oh oh hey creeper Thank you, and I got another point, didn't I? Oh, hey. Sweet. Get lots of nice stuff. Oh, I'm gonna die if I don't need anything. So, now, where were we? Gold pipe, yes, okay. Pipe, throw it down. Right along here. Let's see. Uh, 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 uh. Uh. Oh, I forgot to put it together, didn't I? So, where is it? Uh, pipe and that. Okay, conductive pipe. That's what we needed. And there we go. Power will start flowing. This thing will start cutting as soon as the reeds are ready. And we can just throw a chest next to it, can't we? Whoa. Where? Up here? Oh, it was an angry zombie. Die. 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 Oh, yeah. Give me your brains. Thank you. Let's throw our stuff in this chest here. 
brains, and gunpowder. Alright, so that's getting power, but it's not going to really need it for the moment. Might as well shut that off. <clears> that <throat> way oh, we don't waste too much power. Oh, that needs to keep warm, doesn't it? We're going to lose all that glass. Shouldn't have thrown so much in there. It's not like we can't get it for free anyway, but... Well, netherrack cost, but... Huh. Thank you. Someone splashing. Oh, there's a zombie up there. Angry one. So as soon as this gets all grown out, we'll be able to start harvesting tons and tons of reeds. We'll make all sorts of books. In fact, maybe every sort of book we'll make. Let's throw this in here. I think if I just attach one of these to the side. Oh. This side. That should work, yeah. If I attach it to the side, I think it'll just pump it directly into this chest, if I recall correctly. Let's see, can I place this on top of there? Okay, so we'll place that up there. So that's three high. Pop some power into this. Turn this on for a second. Get the power to go up through here. And it should break off that if I counted correctly. Huh. Let's go a little bit closer for the moment. One, two, three. Now break it off. Break it. Break it. Break it. Maybe I need. I'm gonna move this down one. I'm impatient. There. Uh, nothing. What about here? If that doesn't work, nothing will. It's got power. Why why you no know work? Hmm. <sighs> At least this will be a really large amount of reeds that'll grow here as soon as it's done, but uh, I wasted diamonds on you. Five, in fact. <coughs> I don't know what else I need to do. I, did, I know it requires buildcraft power, and that's buildcraft power. And it's really, it's pretty close by. It shouldn't be having an issue. Huh? What the? Oh, hey, there, it worked. Okay. So, all's well. It's going to work. I guess I just had some bad timing or something. Either way, that's going to be it for today. You know, it's just a little bit of a short episode. Kind of an update on what's been going on. Make sure you guys know I'm still alive and <laughs> making videos for you. I'm, uh, next episode, we're going to, you know, get the nether area set up nice and well. I've actually been making a bunch of marble brick just for that, because I think it'll look real. The brick. I don't like the marble so much, but the brick actually has quite a good little texture to it. And I think if we make it out of that, it'll look nice. Plus, you know, accent blocks and whatnot. And I might even make one of those axes and set up some of the micro block stuff. I haven't tried that before, and maybe we can try it together and see how well it works out. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Make sure you leave a like if you did. Subscribe if you want to see more. And I'll see you guys next time.